today we are at the BFI South Bank and we are filming a video for the, the next single, or new single, uh, called Written in Red. something um, that's quite abstract and um, really more to do with um, colours and shapes and interesting um, movements. The projections are over us and so it's, it, it almost obscures us at points. I suppose the concept is like the, the, the song has quite a strong kind of rhythmic element to it and so I think the concept of it is more just like the lighting and the kind of um, trying to trying to create an atmosphere that, that, that suits the song. I mean, it's, it sounds quite upbeat, and it, but it's I guess it's similar to a lot of our stuff. It sounds quite positive and upbeat in the, in the melody, but actually, if you dig into it a bit, it's quite um, it's quite dark. The last video that we did was quite um, quite summery and quite happy and stuff like that, and um, well, kind of full happiness, if you will, if that's the right word. So I think it's just trying to do something different. I've done a few music videos, but they've, they've all been for solo artists. So it's interesting to work for a band and kind of sort of, you know, make sure you get coverage of all of them. But no, it's, it's good, it's good. It livens it up a bit more and it's nice to get a sort of relationship going within the video between different band members, get more of a dynamic going. Uh, I enjoy making videos, actually. Um, I know a lot of people don't like it. Uh, Gary's not a biggest fan. Uh, but I enjoy, because the recording process at the moment that we've got is very separate and we all kind of, I'll go in and I'll record my guitar parts and Gary's already recording his drums and the keyboards go on after and then the vocals go separately. Um, and this is an opportunity for us all to be together. It's, um, yeah, it's, um, it's quite interesting really, but as long as it doesn't kind of like last four days or something like that, then I'm all right. But it's, you know, you're doing it with your best mates, aren't you? So it's, uh, it's always a bit of a giggle, kind of take the mickey out of James for four hours straight, and that's, you know, I'm a happy man. I think the way it's going to be edited, again, it's hard to see, because when we're filming at the moment, um, it's, it's a bit like you're standing there, there's light shining in your face, you don't really know how that's going to look, but like we, I think the way it's going to be edited is going to kind of move, move with the rhythm of the song, so we're kind of, um, yeah, it, it's... I don't know, exactly know the concept, but I think it's just to try and uh, make it look as good as possible. <laughs> I also like uh, being part of something that uh, is coming together and it's kept someone else's control completely. When we're recording, we often have a lot of input in what we're doing, but with this, it's someone else's vision, so it's quite nice to collaborate. Well, I really hope they're going to like it. I think they'll like it. It's sort of, um, we're really proud of it, and, and I feel really passionate about it. So, um, I think that people that will that will kind of translate across